Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Welcome back, you birthday people. Okay, so you birthdays people. Okay, so for the birthday people, I'm changing up the weekly readings and uh, happy birthdays. Let's see what the unicorns have. This reading is going to be going for the coming week. Okay. So let's see what's happening for the birthday people. We have a laughter for you guys, and we hear and we have finished what you have started, and I hope you guys can see this. So for the birthday people, I've been uh, guided to use Archangel Michael. So we are going to be using Archangel Michael to see what's coming up for you guys. And this is going to be good. So we see laughter and we have finish what you have started. We have your guided and protected and detach from this situation. So ladies and gentlemen, happy birthday. Happy birthdays to everyone out there. Um, sorry for the break with the weekly readings. I had so much on my plate. I have a full time job and uh, life. <laughs> was going fast so um we're back now and we are going to be doing the birthday reading so let's see what basically is coming out so the problem and the, the, the situation for you guys in this year um as we look at your birthday reading is that life is about to start for you guys you know that's how i say um to people that you know life has its way and in a, each and every year you will realize that there is something new that is coming up um each and every year you work with another um angel in whatever way um they come up you work with other angels um to um basically basically um um work out whatever images that is going on life is wonderful whatever the situation is whatever that is transpiring we have to understand that life brings us a lot of experience and we need, just need to learn from our experience, okay? So this year for you guys is that um, laughter for some of you is going to be good. Uh, laugh at the, the silly, strange things that happens that sometimes you wonder, oh, am hey, you know, oh, am hey you know how m k but you know at the end of the day we definitely definitely have to laugh at the things that we see goes on especially the ego of other people and that sort of a situation so um that's how we're looking at um, situations at the sun ladies and gentlemen i want to say to all of you um be aware that uh, sometimes we have certain experience we have to experience certain things so be aware of the situation and when things comes up just laugh at what is coming up because sometimes other people egos are just plain rampant and you just have to understand um, that we are on this planet to learn from each other so again happy birthday happy birthday to, to you guys please remember to check out also the weekly reading for your um, zodiac sign because this is the birthday reading for the people who are having birthdays but also in this week there is going to um and always um with a birthday um reading always check out your own readings because sometimes there are other messages for the week that is coming up this is just for the birthday and that's how we're looking at it so laughter is going to be the key ladies and gentlemen laughter is going to be the key so Whatever the situation is and whatever is transpiring, laughter is the key. You're guarded and protected by Archangel Michael in this year for some of you. And um, this is positive. I love these energies. And the universe is always here supporting you guys on your journeys. For some reason, I was pushed towards whoever is here. Um, some of you need to finish something in this year. Is it a book? Um, is it something you have been working on? Is it a project? Is it a study? You need to get this finished, okay? You have started something that is very important. You need to get this um, finished. 
and now is the time to finish it in this year some of you stay away from drama it says detach from a situation Archangel Michael I ask you to use your flame of swords to cut um, any attachment from fear and drama so that I may be centered in knowingness that, that peace is everywhere in me and with this situation okay and remember that whatever the situation is know that laughter is the key you're guided and protected by the universe and um, finish what you have started and detach from whatever situation whatever drama that wants to come in your life detach from it because um, we need to do that okay so happy birthday again and we are going to go in the reading so let's see what's coming up for you birthdays people who are having birthdays I see what's coming up for you guys this is just going to be wonderful that's a good energy when the strength is in reverse okay so um, that is a good energy is um, because you are learning um, to find the inner strength okay a lot of you are going to be receiving a lot of information that is going to be coming at you in this year definitely a lot of you are going to be receiving a lot of information um, it could be an eye opener, a year that becomes an eye opener for you. This is wonderful, it's positive. You're in alignment with your own energies, and this is good. Okay, so these are wonderful situations that is happening, even though sometimes we think that life is just so full of mysteries. And what is going to be happening is that um, this reading is from the um the 11th the 12th until the 18th so this reading is from the 12th until the 18th so if you're um someone who is having birthdays uh, um may 12th until may 18 you tauruses happy birthday okay let's go in and see what is happening what is transpiring for you birthday people so for the people who were um, born on the 12th you're dealing with the energy of the lover in this year and as you deal with the energy of the lover in this year we're going to be looking to see whatever else is aligning with you and I always do not like to use the same deck because I feel as if uh, there are different situations and scenarios sometimes we don't have the same energies so let's look and see what's the energy of the lovers for the people who were born on the 12th of May. What is the energy of the lovers? Woo! Double whammy. Some of you could be getting married. Um, some of you could be moving in together. This is a wonderful energy that is definitely coming up. So um, be aware of this. Um, a lot of you are going to be connecting. A lot of you are going to be getting married. But a lot of you are also going to be meeting your soulmate eight okay so this is good um so for the people who were born on the 12th of may this is wonderful it is good um let's see what other energies i will not take another card because except from this deck because it is a beautiful energy a double warming for you guys so it's going to affect all of you who were born the 12th there's going to be a resolution a resolution is definitely coming up for you guys so um, let's say you were living apart for some time and that sort of a thing there is definitely going to be a resolution um, you guys um, could be having conflicts in your life there's definitely going to be a resolution some of you could be marrying and moving in together some of you could be buying your dream house some of you um, your husband or wife could be um, surprising you um, without you even knowing so that is a beautiful energy that is coming up so happy birthday and I'm wishing you all the best I want you guys to the rest of you to know that whatever is happening with your relationship some of you are going to be meeting twin flame soulmates that is coming up also because you have a double whammy which is going to affect all of you okay let's move on and see what it is that is coming up for the people who were born on the 13th of um, um, May now 
you ladies ladies you are going to be starting a new journey and you are going to be financial abundant okay so you ladies ladies so um, it's gonna affect most of the ladies that you're going to be starting a new journey and you are going to be financial stable some of you could be having relationships and this could come up as a child that you have to deal with that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius be aware of the situation this person is there so be aware um, if you are someone who is financial stable um, this person could be trying to do something but you could be getting rid of this person in this year so if you're dealing with um, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius you could have a situation with this person but definitely this person is going to be out of your life yeah so here we are is that some of you could be dealing with this person and this person was trying to use their power to do something and whatever they were using their power to do it's not going to um, work out in their best effort because you are going to be finding out and you're going to be guarding yourself in the best possible way and this is going to be good so some of you are going to find your inner power to deal with this person whoever this person is is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius so some of you are definitely but for the rest of it it's going to be a very very beautiful year the yes energy of uh, um, the fool is the yes energy some of you are going to be really really um, receiving a lot of money in this year okay so congratulations everyone is saying that 13 is, a, is an unlucky number no you are an angel in disguise okay let's look at the people who were born on the 14th of May we have the energy of strength in reverse and you are going to definitely receive um, a message and this message is going to be good because it's as if in this year that is coming up for you people who are born on the 14th is as if you know how to use your strength and however it is you are going to be using your strength in the right way form and the right order there is going to be new starts coming up for you guys because it's as if the universe is going to be opening up for you it's as if the last couple of years you have been finding inner strength and now it's as if you have learned how to deal with it and what is going to be transpiring is definitely that the stars the universe your guides and angels are going to be opening up be careful there could be some deception there could be some theft and deception so be aware of this um, and um, open up your eyes to your surround surrounding but if this is the situation definitely you're going to be finding out about this and this is going to be resolved okay you're definitely going to be finding about it and it's going to be resolved now for the people who are born under 15 congratulations you have your own energy vibration this is powerful it's going to be a really really powerful year for you guys because you are vibrating in your own energy vibration and this is the energy of the heavenly master so for you guys you guys could be realizing that you're becoming very spiritual you're learning how to work with spirituality you're understanding who you are you're understanding why you're here and this is going to be good so let's see for the people who were born on the 15th of May what is going to be coming out there is definitely justice that is going to be coming there is going to be justice against an organization okay something has happened something has transpired and some of you could be bringing out this justice or this organization could have seen what has happened what has transpired and they are going to be bringing something in balance so this is going to be good but all the messages coming out really whatever the deception is and whatever deception that is played it is as if the universe or you yourself is going to join in collaboration in this year so a lot of you could be clearing out other karmas out with other people so be aware of this okay but it's going to be a very powerful year because you're working in your own energy vibration which is the earth element and which is the event master that is really going to be helping you what else is coming out for the people who are having birthday on the 15th definitely you're going to be receiving an invitation because it's as if um, an organization has found out it could be that someone was using your information um, people were lying people were trying to deceitfully do something against you and this is definitely definitely going to be um, coming out that it is happening that uh, um, things are going to be coming out uh, 
um, and uh, you know, it's as if an organization realized something that has happened and something that has just transpired. It could be you also helping other people, and by helping other people, this help is going to be coming in. Um, let's look at the hangman. The energy of the hangman is here for the people who were born on the 16th. What is it? Ooh, double whammy again, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be a beautiful, beautiful year for you Tauruses. OMG, look at that, look at that. You have a double whammy with the lovers. It's going to affect everyone. If you were born from the 12 until the 18, there is a double whammy that is coming out. It's going to be affecting everyone in this year. So be aware and be aligned. What else is coming out? Yes, situations are going to be opening up. You're going to be seeing the truth of situation. Things that weren't clear is now basically going to be very, very clear what has been happening, what has been transpiring, and this is going to be powerful. This is going to be a wonderful wonderful year for you guys because whatever the situation is and that was plain you're definitely luck is here luck is on your side congratulations again some of you definitely who were born on the 16 even though you have the energy of the hangman in the reverse twice that means you could be connecting with your own spirituality you could be connecting with yourself this is going to be wonderful this is going to be good whatever that was um, being hidden is going to come out in the open and there is a lot a lot that is going to be coming to you because things that was not um things that was hidden is now going to be coming out and this is going to be good for you guys so this is just going to be beautiful and wonderful very nice energies as you guys can see because whatever the resolution and the solution is there is fast resolution and solution between two people between a husband and a wife, between soulmates and twin flame, between people who are just in normal relationship. And some of you are going to be finding the power and the, the, the authority uh, against a deceptive move that has made. And after that, you're going to be getting news. So whatever is transpiring in this seven days from the 12th to the 18 expect that all of you is going to have at some time in this new year this energy coming at you so definitely lovers twin flames soulmates you're going to be meeting each other definitely some of you are going to be seeing the truth to situation that wasn't there luck is going to be coming for a lot of you okay so let's look at the people who were born on the 17. We have the energy of the Empress. This is a wonderful situation. Whatever situation that was blocking you is now coming to an end, okay? Whatever the situation that was blocking your financial flow, that was blocking you as a person trying to move forward, this is definitely going to be happening for you. And this is going to be good. So these are wonderful energies that is coming up. And these energies are going to be aligning you in really positive, positive ways. And this is going to be good. So congratulations. Let's see what else is coming. Because definitely a block is going to be lifted. So some of you were dealing with a block. And uh, this block, see, these are just negative energies that was around you. And if you notice the tower, the blocks, they're going to be lifted. Um, and they're going to be coming to an end. They're going to be lifted and coming to an end for the people who were born on the 16th. So expect that in this year, a lot of transition, a lot of situations is going to be coming out. The Wheel of Fortune for the people who were born on the 18th. This is good. This is wonderful. Positive energies. Let's see what is coming out with the Wheel of Fortune. Um, the Eight of Cups. You're planning your way forward because the Wheel of Fortune is going to bring you guys some luck. Some wonderful luck is going to be coming in. This luck has to do with house. I'm seeing a lot of people at house and work. Um, some of you are going to be changing living space. Some of you are going to be changing work. Some of you are going to be planning. Some of you are going to be getting out of situation that you were in. Luck is coming. Unexpected surprise. Luck is coming. So this is going to be a very lucky year for um, 
you um people who were born on the 18th it's going to be a performed lucky lucky year for you guys because what is happening and what is transpiring is basically the universe is saying hey you have been going through so much and now we are going to be bringing you some luck ladies and gentlemen please leave a message let me know how this year is going to turn out for you definitely strong stability is coming in wonderful energies are coming in namaste until next time.